stop buying more courses. Stop wasting your time and money to create a website which is taking you thousands of hours. You want to become a freedom entrepreneur. Stop wasting your money and start doing one thing. One really important thing, you want to have your business online, but you don't want all the overwhelm. So stop wasting your time and money to programs and courses and books. And yes, it's super important to learn and to keep learning. And so am I doing the same thing. But in the beginning, when I was starting out, you get so overwhelmed with, oh, buy my program and buy this affiliate and buy this and buy that. And I like, and I was just learning, learning and, and doing all of these things, but I didn't take action. I didn't take one specific action to actually see results and grow my business because I was being busy, being busy. And I don't want that for you. If you don't know me already, then I am Rachel Smets and I escaped my corporate job to live a freedom lifestyle and to travel the world and to be in magnificent locations. And I'm helping other ambitious professionals to create this escape plan because I do not believe in the leap of faith and just follow your heart and jump without a parachute. No way you need a plan if you want to do it right and how to do it right is what i'm going to talk about is one secret action one action that you have to take so that you can see results and that you start growing your business without being overwhelmed and without having to buy more courses and more programs and more this and that and that there's a japanese program that says a vision without action is a daydream. An action without a vision is a nightmare. So you don't just want to daydream and you certainly don't want a nightmare, but you do want to make your dreams come true. You do want to make money online. You do want to grow your business. So it's time for action. And you may wonder, Rachel, what kind of action? Well, here's the thing. You know how to bake a cake. You follow a recipe, right? You take a bowl, you add some flour, then you add some sugar, then you add some eggs, and you just follow the steps of the recipe. And then you put the whole, you know, bunch of ingredients, and not, I'm not a good cook, I'm sorry about that, but you get my picture. And then you take everything, you take the bowl, you put it in the oven, and then you wait, and then after 45 minutes, bing, and the cake is ready. You do not take the bowl empty, put it in the oven and then ping, you know, your cake is ready. No, it doesn't work like that. You have to follow the steps in the right order. What happens when you just start out and you want to make money online, you want to make passive income, you want to grow online. What happens is that you're looking everywhere online and I admit I made that mistake as well. And then you get overwhelmed because, oh, and it's so easy to make passive income and you just need to buy this affiliate program and buy this course. And no, you do not because you're just starting out. And the one thing that you do need is, wait for it, clarity. And I'm gonna explain this, okay? Because I want you to take action with what I'm gonna say. Because right now, all there is is chaos. You move from chaos, when you have clarity, you will have the confidence. And with the confidence, you get the courage. And with courage, you can take action to actually see results and get some money online. I also am guilty of being busy with being busy, but I wasn't clear. And that's what I was missing. The very, very, very first thing is that I wasn't clear what skills am I going to take from my corporate job into my online business? What skills can I use? Who will I work with? What do I want to offer? Who is this ideal client? And so as soon as I really dived into the clarity for myself and my future online business, that is when things started to shift. But all the time that I was looking at courses and programs and listening to this person and that person and watching a ton of webinars and YouTube videos and it's all good and interesting, but I wasn't doing anything. I wasn't really taking specific action. I wasn't following the recipe of baking a cake. I wasn't taking step one and two and three because I was already you know, looking at step six and seven 
It's like you take the elevator from the first floor to the 10th floor. You know, you go through the first and the second and the third and the fourth floor up to the 10th. You don't go from the first to the 10th. And I was already looking in the 10th. I was completely chaotic, overwhelmed. No, first the clarity. Then comes the confidence because I knew exactly what I was doing and then the courage and then I could take those steps. All right. So I want you to get clear, get clear on, first of all, what skills do you have? What are your values? What are your strengths? What do you have to offer? Then get clear on who is your ideal client? Who do you want to work with? You cannot work with the whole wild world. I have clients that come to me like, oh, but I'm a transitional coach and I'm a life coach and oh, I can help anybody really who's just feeling stuck. No, you can't. I mean, I'm sure you can, but the, the thing is, if you want to create a valuable post online, if you want to create your website, if you want to create any value content, you have to be clear on who you are, who you will serve, what you will do exactly. So it's not just being a life coach. For me, in the beginning, I was also all over the place. Yeah, I can, I can help expats because I've been living abroad for so long. I'm traveling the world. I can help those. I'm also a good life coach, but I also came from corporate, so I can, I can be a career coach. I was, I was like all over the place. No, now I know exactly because I took the steps. I transitioned from my corporate job into being an online course, a, a course creator, being an online coach helping people transition and making an, a clear escape plan with clear steps from corporate to transition into the online world, get more visible, get clarity on your ideal client and your offer, and then grow that visibility and then get results, get money online. So I'm helping my clients, and that's what I do specifically, I'm helping them specifically to transition while you're still in a job. How do you combine that with building your online? Because I always say, do not take the leap of faith. Don't jump without a parachute. You can't swim if you, you know, you, you will drown, right? If you don't take the, the, the swimming um, lessons first. So it's all about making a plan and then prioritizing things. So I want you to look at where you are right now, because some of you may be in the very, very beginning, still working a job, not really knowing what to do. I want you to really think, okay, what is my next actionable step? Instead of looking all over online, instead of being overwhelmed, instead of buying more courses, creating a website, what is the clarity that you need to figure out? If you're already growing a little bit and putting your first steps into the online world, again, do you have clarity about who you are, who you will serve, what exactly you will do? I want you to really, that's the action I want you to take instead of going outside of you or yourself looking at others i want you to go within and write down um you know what what are those those clear steps that you are taking what is the clarity that you have and then you can start taking the next step follow the recipe all right i also want to say talk to me if i can help you I talk to so many people. I will book my, my link, my calendar link right below this video in the comments so you can have a talk with me because I, I love helping people. It's what I do with creating this clarity because I know as long as I try to do everything myself, it's not possible. You're so overwhelmed and you're so in the middle of it. It's so hard to see that clarity within yourself and it will take you so much time to figure things out on your own. Just know that you are not alone and a lot of people are out there to help you. So whether you ask me or somebody else, ask somebody for help who has walked the path before you. I want you to you know, always go to somebody who's been in your shoes. And if you haven't watched those videos before, like, you know, don't be that crap. My last week's video, like, you know, don't be the crap because the, the crap family pulls you back and your family is trying to keep you safe and secure and they don't want you to jump and they don't want you to create that freedom lifestyle. But I want you to create that lifestyle because if it's in you, if you have that passion, you have to go for it. So I want you to take action, but I want you to take the right action. So talk to me or talk to another coach or someone who has walked the path before you. Make sure you have the clarity and take it one step after the other. Do not go there and be overwhelmed and chaotic and chaos leads to 
more chaos. Don't do that. I will see you again in my next video. Make sure you subscribe to my channel because I make videos every single Wednesday to help you overcome the fear, take charge of your life, take responsibility and escape your nine to five rat race. I'm here for you. I thank you and I'll see you next week.